sleep for the night mm -hmm. and you're done with everything for the night, mm -hmm. you're going to hit your head on the pillow. You're completely not letting anyone else or anyone else come in or out. Mm -hmm. You're going to say arm stay. Okay. Arm stay means that you're staying in the house. No one else should appear. Mm -hmm. So at any given point, if a door opens or if a light goes off, the motion detector is going to detect the motion. Mm -hmm. The sensors are going to go off if you do not put in the password Why within enough stay? time. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. So within those 60 seconds that you have, you have up until that point to at least put the passcode in. If not, it's going to go off in the entire alarm. So mm -hmm. you have an additional 30 seconds that you can add, but you don't have to if you're just staying in for the night. Okay. In order to cancel the alarm, you have to put in the passcode. Ready to okay. Arm. okay. That works. All right. So away. So arm away, meaning that I'm about to leave. I don't plan on returning anytime soon. Mm -hmm. I want to have all my stuff protected. I don't want anyone to intrude in my privacy. Mm -hmm. So you hit arm away. Arming away. So you have essentially 60 seconds to get out the door. Mm -hmm. If that is not enough time for you, you can add on an additional 30. Give okay. you a minute and 30 seconds to get out the home. Okay. Right before you hit it, everything else will go into arm mode and be able to detect what's going in and out. Mm -hmm. The only way to disarm this at that point, once you walk back in, will be to input the passcode. Okay. System disarmed. Mm -hmm. Ready to arm. Okay. Mm -hmm. This does not need to be mounted, but it can be mounted if you want it to be. But it will just leave an area with this cord also to you. The reason I left it this way is because it's portable, meaning that it doesn't need to always be on a charge, but you can place it anywhere in the home. Mm -hmm. You don't have to have this around you because you guys both have key fobs. Mm -hmm. So the key fob is an easier dismissal to everything that I was saying, which makes it mm -hmm. which makes it so you don't have to punch in the code at all. So you have the key fob on you, right? Yes, I got it. Okay, hit R for me. Yes, sir. Test. My what? Um, I haven't gotten that far yet, sir. Oh, that's Cove? Mm-hmm. Okay. Password? Password? Is that it? Or? Well, there would have been a password that you guys would have had in regards to this. Not anything I would have known. Okay. I'm just setting up your security for everything. They're checking to make sure that it's done correctly. Oh, so that's okay. why they called. Okay. Well, um, can you call me back in about 10 minutes? <laughs> oh, well, see, I don't know. You need to talk to my husband. He gave you my number, but he didn't give me the password, and I haven't the slightest idea what it is. Okay. Okay. Okay, so when you hit the button that you have up there on either one of your key fob, mm -hmm. it's just an easier way to bypass everything without having to hit any of the numbers. So if mm -hmm. you wanted to hit stay, stay is going to make it so that everything arms. If you want to hit away, away is going to make it so that everything arms. And once you hit this arm, everything is going to disarm on either end and you don't have to punch in the code. Okay. So that was all. I wanted to make sure. Okay. 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 Okay.